child with autism may have difficulty in the areas of communication and socialization. Music therapy uses music as a bridge that these children use to make a social connection and spur growth. Here to tell us more about the music therapy programs offered at Buffalo Hearing and Speech Center is Jenna Kellogg and Erin McGarry. Thank you so much for being here today. Jenna, start with what music therapy is. So a lot of people don't actually know what music therapy is, and that's why we're here is to talk about it a little bit. Um, music therapy is an established healthcare profession that uses music to establish and meet non-musical goals. So we work with people with all kinds of different disabilities um, to work on speech goals, social goals, um, occupational therapy, such as fine, gro fine and gross motor skills. Um, we do all kinds of different um, interventions through music that can establish and work on these goals. And so Erin, help me understand how you use music in your therapy to help a child with an autism spectrum because I know it's a big spectrum. Right, well the great thing about music is that it's so adaptable and universal mm -hmm. and to create that connection for kids with autism, they already have um, a unique connection to music most often and music accesses all these different areas of the brain so we're working on motor skills by playing instruments with them we're working on speech by singing we're working on social interaction by making that on eye contact and things like that through the improvisation and it looks like you can really make some huge advancements with the children Yes, we have seen kids who are normally very withdrawn in the classroom and in other environments and presented with singing and the music and those instruments, all of a sudden they're singing with us and they're making that eye contact. And for a child with autism, that's very huge. And those positive changes because of music therapy is just what every parent wants. Yes. They just want to see their child come out of that shell. When we're talking about, Jenna, the type of music therapy that you do, do you have to go to the center to get this music therapy? Uh, no, you don't. We do a lot of different programs with um, schools throughout the community. We contract out. We see both preschool age children as well as school age children. Um, and we travel all throughout the community. So while we do have programs at Buffalo Hearing and Speech Center at our different sites, we mm -hmm. also can travel out to different sites as well. One of the ways that people can get help from Buffalo Hearing and Speech Center is to go through their school to be tested through Buffalo Hearing and Speech, mm -hmm. is that correct? Yes, we actually conduct evaluations. Um, we're looking for children that show a, an increase in response when they're in a musical environment. So some kids might be very withdrawn, especially children with autism, we see a lot of withdrawal. Um, but sometimes if you introduce music into their world, you start seeing a lot more um, eye contact and interaction. So we use that in the evaluation we see if they're showing an increase in response and if that's the case they might be a good candidate for music therapy. I can't encourage parents it, whatever school that you're at is to get the evaluation because then Buffalo Hearing and Speech can come in through the school district mm -hmm. and help the child. Yeah absolutely. Mm -hmm. And so um, how, how many steps ahead do you think the music therapy helps if you both were to if you both were to guess and you take a child and they're starting at this step how mm -hmm. far can you get them to move forward in progress and communication? Well, basically our job is to work with the other therapists, um, so we're working with our speech, our OT, our PTs, um, our social workers, and we're pushing what goals they've established with our own goals as well, so we can really spur that growth and development quite a bit. With and really music. the sky is the limit with mm -hmm. their potential. We're working on all these goal areas simultaneously in one therapy, mm -hmm. so there's really no limit to their potential for growth. I can only imagine how beautiful that music must be. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much <laughs> for telling us about this program. Thank you. I'm so about music therapy. <laughs> Buffalo Hearing and Speech Center with locations in Buffalo, Williamsville, West Seneca, and Wheatfield, one of the largest nonprofit independent speech and hearing centers in the country. They've been serving Western New Yorkers of all ages for 60 years. If you want more information about the Center's Music Therapy for Children diagnosed on the autism spectrum or any of the many programs that they have and services offered at Buffalo Hearing and Speech Center, just give them a call, 885-8318, or visit online at askbhsc.org. It's important to note that a child does not necessarily have to visit a Buffalo Hearing and Speech Center site to receive music therapy. Off-site treatments are available. Just call the Center for details. Now,